Hi everybody, it is Jen in Canada, and I just wanted to share with you a way to not waste food. Here is my two pumpkins that we had carved for jack-o'-lanterns. I turned them upside down on the cookie sheet, so all the juices go in there, and just roasted them for th at 350 for just under an hour. And all I'm going to do now is once they cool, is just peel off the skin. And look at that beautiful pumpkin flesh. Now, these pumpkins aren't going to waste. They're going to be feeding my family. I'm going to puree the fill like this. I'm going to use it for pumpkin pancakes that I'm going to freeze, make some freezer meals with them. Pumpkin scones, pumpkin muffins, pumpkin pie, everything pumpkin. Right now it's still hot. Turn off the oven so I just gotta cool this down. And get this. I would probably get about oh probably about 20 cups of pumpkin. From a dollar fifty pumpkin. I paid a dollar forty nine each of these pumpkins, so three dollars. That is cheaper than a can of pumpkin. Now, this will have more water than the traditional can, can of pumpkin puree, but you can cook it down and it will release more water. What I'm going to do, so once I get this out of here, is take the pumpkin mash and put it into a colander and drain more liquid out and then just puree it. The extra liquid is not a big deal because I'll be, oh, I'm also going to be making a curry pumpkin soup too. So I just thought I would share it with you. Don't throw out your pumpkins. Um, use them to feed your family. And that is how it is. See, it's not burnt. It's just, see, underneath it's nice and roasted. This one was uh, closer to the burner but it's not burnt at all that's just the skin and we don't eat the skin but makes it nice and yummy for all your pumpkin needs and anything that i don't use the next couple days in my baking i'm just gonna freeze so if you like this type of idea uh, please like, share, and subscribe, and comment below of what other things do you use that you don't throw things out. Bye, friends!